Hello and welcome to the very first Project Corner video. In this video I will walk you through the installation of Project Pro for Office 365. And as an added bonus I will let you know how to install the Office Insider version of this product. Let's head over to the My Account page. This is on part of your Office 365 subscription. And in it, you can set things like security, look into your um, subscriptions, app permissions, and all the like. What we're mainly focusing on is the installation status. Now you can install any Office 365 application five times on any of the devices that you own. Um, there's two ways to enter the installation status. There's a menu on the left as well as a menu in the center of your screen. So let's head over to the installation status page and see what we can do there uh, in comparison with Office 365 and Project. So in the installation status page, you can see that there's Office installed there's project installed and there's Visio installed. And these are mainly separate items because they are different subscriptions. Now for the most interesting part here is the link on top. It's called the Insta install desktop applications. So let's head over there. Keep in mind that this is an Office 365 subscription. So obviously we'll start at the Office page on the left there's different tools that you can access. So tools and add-ins, project, Visio, Skype for business, and there's even a phone and tablet section for phone specific or tablet specific apps. But depending on your subscription, you'll see more or less in this page. And we're mainly focused on projects. So let's head over there. Now this page, you can install project and you can set a couple of parameters such as the language settings if that's not natively English you can change that of course and there's a bit section on the versions so you can set that to 32 bits or 64 bits um, but for now let's keep it at the recommended 32 bits so next step is to click on install now what will happen is that a menu will pop up asking you to run a uh, an executable and as soon as you click on run a new pop-up window will show you that if you have any Microsoft applications open Microsoft Office applications open for it to be specific Microsoft will help you close those down now you can do that yourself or you can either let the app do this I just let the app do this to show you this uh, short menu. Now, once that's done, a new pop-up shows up and it says, uh, please stay online while Office is downloading. And I've speeded up this, uh, this section because yeah, this might take some time depending on your computer settings or computer, um, so depending on your computer settings or your internet connection, this might take you up to 15, maybe 20 minutes. Here we go, it's uh, telling us it's updating Office. And once this is done, a new window will show up telling you that you're all set. There you go. So you're all set and the new Office application is installed. Now in this section, it doesn't really tell you which Office application is installed, but we're pretty sure that's Microsoft Project. So let's click on close. And let's also close this button up here. And let's head over to Microsoft Project. From the start menu, I already have it here in my uh, middle section or the start menu it is called and here we go so a blank project or maybe a template project would be your first cho choice and here is a nice little Gantt chart 
Now, as I mentioned before, I would like to introduce you to the Office Insider program. To do that, you have to have two uh, files, and if you're part of the newsletter, you'll be part. Uh, you'll be given those uh, files. So there's a setup, and there's a configuration. And first, what you need to do is make sure that you have the configuration file correctly installed. If you open that using um, using any Notepad program such as Notepad++, you'll have the option to change the version to 64 or 32. For our situation, that was 32. So let's save this application. And let's close that down. Now what you don't want to do is directly click on setup, but rather you will open up a prompt, a command prompt in an administrator mode, and you will add, navigate to the Office Insider folder that you where you have installed those files, and then you'll set up .exe slash configure configuration.xml. Now once you're doing this and you hit enter, a new pop-up window will show up, giving you a nice overview of the next office version that's being installed. Now, just like before, this uh, little section is sped up because, uh, yeah, this might take up to 15, 20 minutes, depending on your internet connection and your machine. But once that's done, you're ready uh, or you are set. And again, it doesn't tell you which Office application is installed, but for us, that's Microsoft Project. And let's find out how we can view that this is really an Office Insider. So heading back to the Microsoft Project application, you should go to uh, the file section and then underneath there's an account and on the right you will see that there is an Office Insider. It's also telling you that the Office updates are automatically installed after it's downloaded so you do need an internet connection and with that you are now an office insider that's it for today uh, this was the first video if you liked it please click on the like button and if you would like to see more you can also subscribe to the channel and get a nice little notification once I'm up for new material